Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into the latest episode of The Boys, Season 4, Episode 5. There's a lot to unpack in this episode, so let's get right into it. And don't forget, I want to hear your thoughts in the comments below. Let's discuss this crazy twist together. So, in this episode, we see Ryan getting more involved with Vought, which is a big concern. Homelander's influence over him is growing stronger, and it's starting to show in some pretty disturbing ways. While the heroes are out searching for a soup virus to take down Homelander, the Seven are making an appearance at the V-52 Expo. This event is like a parody of Disney's D-23 Expo, where Vought is promoting their upcoming movies and TV shows. Naturally, the Seven are there, and Ryan is also present as part of Vought's PR strategy. This alone is worrying because Ryan being showcased by Vought means they're grooming him for something big. But what's even more troubling is what's happening behind the scenes. Ryan's behavior in this episode is really making me anxious about his future. I thought I had a handle on where his character was heading, but now, I'm not so sure. Despite spending more time with Homelander and Vought, Ryan remains somewhat sympathetic. But after this episode, I'm seriously worried about where his character is going. While backstage at the V-52 Expo, Ryan has a pretty intense encounter with Adam Burke. Now, Adam is harassing one of Vought's female production assistants, which rightfully angers Ryan. However, at Homelander's urging, Ryan takes things way too far. Ryan forces Adam to apologize, but when Adam's apology isn't sincere enough, Ryan escalates the situation. He demands that Adam get on his knees and apologize, and when Homelander suggests it's still not enough, Ryan has the PA slap Adam repeatedly. This is where things get really dark. Ryan seems to take pleasure in this whole scenario. He's smiling, sipping a milkshake, and clearly enjoying watching Adam get beaten. It's a disturbing moment for a character who has never shown this kind of behavior before. It really highlights just how much Homelander is influencing him. We've always known that Ryan has the potential for darkness, but season four is really bringing that to the forefront. Up until this episode, his actions weren't overly concerning. The show has hinted at his potential to become a villain, but it wasn't until now that it felt like a real possibility. I was already disappointed when Ryan chose Homelander over Butcher, and his lack of concern when Homelander killed a protester was alarming. But despite all this, Ryan has often shown more morality than his father. He feels awful when he accidentally kills someone and has expressed a desire to help people. Homelander, of course, twists this desire to suit his own agenda. He convinces Ryan that they're helping by saving the PA, but doesn't guide him on how to properly handle the situation. Without proper guidance, Ryan could easily follow in Homelander's footsteps. Raised by Becca, Ryan has a basic sense of morality, which initially made me think he wouldn't go down this dark path. But seeing how Homelander normalizes such brutal behavior, I wouldn't be surprised if Ryan ends up as a villain. Homelander remains the main antagonist of the boys, but the show is clearly setting up the possibility of Ryan becoming a villain too. There are plenty of hints suggesting that Ryan's arc might take a dark turn, and the CIA is obviously worried about the chaos that could result from having two unstoppable soups on the loose. Ryan has the potential to be a true hero more so than Homelander. But if Butcher can't find a way to separate them, the boys might have to deal with both of them in the end. This would be especially tragic given Becca's dying wish. Episode 5 of Season 4 takes a significant step towards making Ryan a villain, though it's not set in stone yet. Hopefully, Butcher can get through to Ryan before Season 5, preventing him from becoming the next Homelander. For Ryan's sake, it's crucial that Butcher persuades him to leave Vought. Otherwise, the team might face an impossible battle against both Homelander and Ryan in the final season. That's all for today's breakdown. What do you guys think? Is Ryan destined to become a villain? Or can he be saved? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more updates on the boys and all your favorite shows. See you next time.